Hello everyone. I hope that you're having a great, wonderful Wednesday. So this is today's daily angel message video, angel card reading from me. And um, once again, thank you for following my work and being my client if you are already. And this reading comes from the romance angels today and as usual this reading is for empaths and highly sensitive people so take what resonates and as always i would love to have your comments and likes on my videos and um so especially this reading resonates with those um I feel who have just recently connected with someone new and you're wondering if that person has the material to be a partner for you for long term and um, we have a very positive card first today romantic feelings your feelings are real and worth exploring so, of course, this is a very positive sign that um, the romance angels are telling you and your guardian angel is telling you along with this message that uh, definitely you can trust the feelings that you're experiencing uh, towards this person and uh, you're not imagining anything because often we might think if we are just imagining something um, whether the feelings that we are feeling are real or um, whether the other person uh, feels the same and of course that is why these readings are very use useful and why these readings are done to help you have some clarity in your love life uh, so just explore those feelings. What are, what are you really feeling towards this person other than romantic feelings? Um, maybe there is something deeper involved than before that you have felt. Or um, maybe you just want to get to know them first and um, take a look at the person who they are and well I'm feeling that you really want to make that deep connection that you do have a lot of interest that you just can't wait to get to know them and um, you're looking for a sign to be sort of validated that this connection is real. But I feel like the angels are giving you good news right now. And um, just try to just clear your mind out of all of the extra... Um, sort of fear-based feelings because you want to be able to clear those out, out first before you get closer to this person often when we need connect with a new love interest of course we want to show our best sides always but but if you have been through a lot before you want to be able to clear out that energy. So you want to make sure that you are really <clears throat> being the most positive self. And <clears throat> of course, when you're feeling much better about yourself and you have inner peace, then it is more possible for you to also feel those romantic feelings and just explore them 
don't try to rush into anything it is so easy to want to trust and to want to rush into a new relationship but you just want to take some time to explore first what the connection is all about uh, the second card today that came out is codependency action <laughs> addictions are affecting your romantic life so this is a warning sign as you can see um, I believe that codependency is a bit common because of a lot of childhood trauma with people uh, because you haven't been fully taken care of as a child so you're looking for that sort of attention and validation even as an adult but I feel like the angels are telling you that you don't need to look for that you don't need to validation you don't need to feel like the other person is completing you because you are already complete so um this is just um sort of a notification from your guardian angel and from the romance angels right now that um you should be healing those childhood wounds because otherwise they will affect your love life and the angels want always only good things for you and your loved ones so of course they want to warn you about this and um i'm feeling that maybe you've been thinking about this topic lately as well and maybe you're even seeing a therapist about this or or someone else or you're seeking for information about this subject but <clears throat> but in the end it's just about you loving yourself first you being an independent person first and not putting pressure on others to validate you because you don't need that and that does not serve anyone so please always know that you are already complete and you are already enough just as you are just as the way you are just as the way you were born and when you are honest with yourself when you are listening to your intuition you are guided clearly very clearly so you want to clear out that that energy and the last card today we have is you deserve love you are lovable so once again the angels want to remind you and your guardian angel wants to remind you that you are so amazing and you are so loved so there is not any love really lacking in your life if, if you could only see how much love there is around you already and you are love yourself so just try to see that because your guides and the angels just love you and the universe loves you and God loves you so there is no need to be feeling sad or or lonely or anything because you are already loved so I hope that this resonated and served you again today and I would love to have your comments on this reading your thoughts and um, so I will um, yeah like I said um, in my last video that I'm going on a holiday so I won't be doing this for uh, for a little over a week but um, as I said you can always contact me if you're interested in your own reading if you're interested in working with me 
so I will keep an eye on my messages anyway once I can but I'm sending you so much love and light and thank you namaste